A case involving pro golfer Tony Finau and members of his family went to a state appeals court today. It centers around wealthy benefactors of the Utah golf star. Fox 13 News reporter Ben Winslow has more from the Matheson Courthouse. At its heart, this case is a contractual dispute between pro golfer Tony Finau, his brother Gipper, and the people who helped finance their start in the golf world. They're accused of taking money from benefactors as they were rising in the ranks under a promise of a cut of their earnings. The money would have been put in a company overseeing the Finau's earnings, but that company dissolved. So one of the backers is suing for his money back, about a half million dollars he claims he's owed. A lower court judge dismissed the lawsuit, finding the statute of limitations for suing for any breach of contract had passed. It's now before the Utah Court of Appeals, which heard arguments over whether to revive it. In what universe of facts could we say that Tony Finau was concealing the income he was making from tour winnings when those tour winnings are all publicly known? How, how could we even say that? We're not just talking about tour winnings. We are talking about Nike endorsements. We are talking about multi-million dollar endorsements, some of which became public and some of which did not. But Mr. Finau back in 2007 was unknown and that has gradually increased over time. There was a question I believe asked about, well, what would have they sued for in 2009? What they would have sued for is the corporation's asset and right to money coming from the golfers. You'd have got, been able to obtain a judgment against that asset. They could have brought the claim in 09. They chose not to. The court took the case under advisement, no timeline for a ruling. At the Matheson Courthouse, Ben Winslow, Fox 13 News, Utah.